the 29th of March, 12.48 p.m. a week after beating the champions Crusaders, the New South Wales Waratahs slumped to a loss at home to the Sun Wolves on Friday. It was the Japanese side's first win on Australian soil in Super Rugby, to go alongside their first win in New Zealand earlier this season against the Chiefs. The Australian side rested some key players, and their absence was certainly noticed, particularly Bernard Foley's, but that does not take anything away from a Sun Wolves team that defended superbly, and took it to a Waratahs defence that had received a lot of plaudits going into the match. The Sun Wolves have had a lot of attention this past week, after being controversially axed from Super Rugby following the 2020 season. In light of this news, and their performance, many fans have questioned the decision-making of SANZAAR on Twitter. This is what they are saying. Fantastic at Sun Wolves result. Great response this week's shoddy treatment by the SANZAR unions. Come on. A petty and need be launched, MJ, Young Admich Young 67, March 29, 2019 Sun Wolves to Super Rugby, pick.twitter.com slash w7rdrwxfwr, Pellas at Pellas 80, March 29, 2019 at Sun Wolves are playing good rugby so let's kick them out after next year. WTF they should stay and so should have at Western Force, Corey, at Cider Chook, March 29, 2019 This is like a cheeky face-off from the Sun Wolves to at Super Rugby HTTPS colon slash slash t dot co slash CSHL8 Kchickle, boardroom underscore bully, at Kess Money, March 29, 2019 Of the two teams that played rugby in Newcastle tonight, can you believe the Sun Wolves are the ones getting punted from the comp? No wonder South African wanted rid of them. Brian Nixadipo, at New York Nixon, March 29, 2019 at Super Rugby Maybe Sanzar must review the decision about the at Sun Wolves. Two big wins for them and both of them is away from home. Well done to Tony Brown and his team. At Super Sport TV at Super Rugbeans at All Blacks, Tian Du Toit, at Toetian, March 29, 2019 Amazing win for the Sun Wolves. And a huge fuck you to SANZAAR for kicking them out of the comp. However, based on how they played against the Waratahs, many fans are bewildered that the decision has been made. While their performance was not great against the Lions in Singapore last weekend, the Sun Wolves came to prove their doubters wrong in Australia this weekend. Many fans feel that this is the perfect response from the Japanese team, who would have been licking their wounds this week. The Sun Wolves played good rugby against the Waratahs, and it is clear that they are a team that are progressing in their fourth season in the competition, and fans were saying that out of the two teams, it is hard to believe that the Sun Wolves are getting the ones getting the chop. Nonetheless, after what has surely been a turbulent week, this was the perfect way for the Sun Wolves to make a statement. You may also like, New Rugby Australia Director of Rugby Scott Johnson on Wallabies RWC 2019 chances tell us what you think about the Rugby World Cup and you could win £100 Super Rugby Sun Wolves for a time.